he has been plastered all over national television, standing side by side with Brian Williams at a Rangers game as the NBC News anchor tries to explain why he lied about his experience in Iraq. And now a Tri-State Army veteran telling our Bryce Onslinger why he didn't speak up. Right. Well, Tanya, I spoke with Army veteran Tim Turpak today. He says he's wanted to say something about the Brian Williams controversy, but he's concerned that every word he says will be dissected as people try to figure out why Williams would lie about his experience in Iraq. The story actually started with a terrible moment a dozen years back during the invasion of Iraq when the helicopter we were traveling in was forced down after being hit by an RPG. He had told the story before, but it was after this NBC Nightly News report that the backlash about Brian Williams claiming he was in a helicopter that was shot down in Iraq really started. Command Sergeant Major Tim Turpak was put in charge of our safety. In the story, Williams talks about his relationship with Ripley County Army veteran Tim Turpak. Turpak was honored alongside Williams at a New York Rangers game for being the person in charge of keeping everyone on the ground safe. During the Iraq invasion, U.S. Army Command Sergeant Major Tim Turpak was responsible for the safety of Brian Williams and his NBC News team after their Chinook helicopter was hit and crippled by enemy fire. Turpak hasn't spoken publicly about the Williams controversy, but he is honored by the national recognition for his service, as you can see from his Facebook page. His cover photos are pics of him and Williams. Turpak says he hasn't said anything publicly about Williams' story being inaccurate because he wasn't in the chopper that was shot down, and he wasn't in the chopper with Brian Williams. Turpak was in charge of the ground forces sent to protect all of the people on the ground, and he got to Williams and his NBC crew three days after they landed. So for Turpak, it was not his place to say what did or did not happen to Williams while in Iraq. And Turpak earned three bronze stars while serving in the Army. He got home Friday after retiring from the service and says he really never expected all this attention from this situation. Bryce Onslinger, not on your side, live in Mount Adams.